food. From the garden to the kitchen to the plate is a basic necessity. And the mutual enjoyment of food in all its forms is the pillar of communities everywhere, including Plymouth, Massachusetts, where gardens are being tended for the harvest. These are sunflower shoots. These are grown in the greenhouse at Center Hill Farm. When she's not in the greenhouse at Center Hill Farm, Melissa Colangelo is tending to the Rye Tavern Vegetable Garden at the Pine Hills in Plymouth. Guests gather at this 18th century tavern for food and drink amid golden fields of rye. Chef Andrew Swain is committed to working with community farms to find the fresh ingredients that make up his locally sourced menu. Not only does it give what I feel is a better quality product, but it also helps support the community and the local farming and agriculture. What we're trying to do is obviously educate the community that's around us and we want to give them that by supporting the farmers. It's just really exciting to know that you can actually know who your farmer is and, and visit these places and buy your produce from them. It's just one of the ways food builds community at the Pine Hills. When we were planning the Pine Hills, we had a focus group. We didn't learn as much from the part behind the glass as we did from the conversation over food and drink afterwards. Sharing a meal is a very intimate activity. If it's someone you didn't know when you started, it's someone you do know pretty well when you're done. So the Pine Hills made food a focus of its village green, with five restaurants and a grocery store drawing shoppers and diners from around the region and the world. At the market, locals and tourists alike can find locally made products like honey and produce picked from one of a dozen farms in the area in season. And food tastings, like the sampling of fresh mozzarella made by an on-site cheesemonger, create a space for the community to come together. You can see it in the way people shop. You can see it in the conversations that happen as people shop. You can see it over a drink at the outdoor bar at the Rye Tavern or at any of these venues where there's conversation and food that are mixing together. The team at Mirbeau likes to create community by taking guests from the French-inspired inn and spa straight to the source of their eclectic dishes. With oyster dinners on a nearby oyster flat and meals celebrating the local cranberry crop set right in a cranberry bog. Food is a pillar of community. You can tell a place by how people get together. You invite people to break bread with you to show that they're important. That's part of how community gets built one meal at a time.